The following video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer's discretion is advised. Hey, my you, you know you watch. Dance, dance, dance. Wow. That looks good. Invention that I know that it already was invented, but you know that looked like someone take some form of drum, metal drum, and turn it into some form of concrete mixer or mortar mixer. Both, if somebody cares, talented. viewers and subscribers big up and respect to each and everyone my name is dancer skill i'm a day here again you see it let me know what you think about uh, that uh, machine right there yeah i would call that a machine so may i say yeah who's to ever invent that thing or who's to ever make that thing it look good i would call that a concrete mixer or a mata mixer yes i may say or just a mixer i like how it look so what I said. Alright, so I have more videos that I'm going to present to you, my viewers and subscribers. And I would like to encourage each and everyone who are new to my channel to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell. So that you can be notified whenever I post a video. Alright? The next video that I'm going to present to you, this video is going to show a person saying some things to a member of the Jamaica Constabulary Force and a member of the Jamaica Defense Force. Now, some persons might consider some of the things that uh, this person said to those law enforcers to be disrespectful. And I would like you, my viewers and subscribers, to take a look at this video and tell me what I think about this video. Now, some harsh language had been used in this video. So before I present this video to you, this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised. Here's the video. Take a look, listen and observe. I used to work right here, and everybody doing it right here. So stop doing that extra shit, nigga. Fuck. Don't do that. Why is he doing it? Why is he talking that extra shit, nigga? You, you, you a cop. Oh, okay. you, you in charge oh, of the crew. Why the fuck did you let him do it all the time, bro? Why you let him do it all the time? You should be doing it all the time. You should be doing it all the time. You should be doing it all the time. You fuck what you want to say to me, bro. They get me angry, they get me mad, man. You don't gotta say nothing. I hit a car, I hit something, I don't fucking know what I hit. Are you making me fucking angry for no reason? <laughs> that is fucking dumb to me, man. You hear me talking about it? Almost out of my body, it's not wild. Fucking not a bad word. I can explain that to you in every fucking language you want me to explain to you. If you ain't gotta care about me, I'm gonna pick up this all my fucking own. The fuck you was bringing soldiers by acting like they stop fucking from a fuck guy or what? I've been everywhere in the world. <laughs> Think about it. Iraq, Afghanistan, every fucking world. Stop letting this fucking cop, this so wannabe cop, cop, come over here. Fuck, man. Are you, are you worried about me or are you worried about the fucking life? I give a fuck! You can do what you want to do. You can do shit to me. The fuck you gonna do? Fight me? Beat me up? What the fuck you gonna do? Thank you. What do you say that? Go away to the... Cause I know it rights. Yeah. Fuck you gonna do? You got to help me help me. You're not. I'm not even looking for 
My people, I wonder what would happen if a Jamaican, using a Jamaican accent of course, say certain things that are considered to be disrespectful to any law enforcers within the country of Jamaica in a situation similar to the one shown in the video that I just presented to you. I wonder what would happen. Yeah? Maybe it depends on the law enforcer because you have some law enforcers who might tolerate certain things but some might not. Yeah, you have some who might tolerate certain things. Yeah, you have good police, you have bad police, you have good soldier, you have bad soldier, you have good civilian, you have bad civilian and so on. You see what I say? Yeah, now the person who you see in the video saying certain things to those law enforcers shown in the video, I cannot tell if that person is a born Jamaican or not because you have some people who born within the country of Jamaica about to migrate gone to a different country somewhere out there in the world and they might have done so at an early age and a situation like that can affect the way how someone talk, you see? Anyways, you know, I'm not going to elaborate much about that video. You can let me know what you think about the video that I just presented to you and I'm going to move on to another video. Now, the next video I'm going to present to you, this video is going to show some things that happened when police from within the country of Guyana interrupted an event that was being held somewhere within the country that is known as Guyana. I don't have any confirmed information as to when the video be recorded. And the video is getting a buzz on social media, so that's one of the reasons why I'm presenting the video to you. And um, I want to say big up and respect to each and every one of my viewers and subscribers within the country that is known as Guyana. Alright, so let me know what you think about this video and here's the video. Take a look, listen and observe. Heinz? Constable Heinz? Very well, son. That's not ignorant. I don't, I don't put ignorance in front of nothing, son. No, because I asked him, was he poor, son? You could let him on with the laptop, Constable Heinz. You could let him on the laptop. Can you just continue speaking to me, sir? No, I have all right to speak to you to ask you questions, sir. I have all right to ask you questions. You can't tell me you can't discontinue. Well, you don't have a choice, Constable Heinz. You don't have a choice. It's nonsense you are talking. You don't ask him how to go to the vehicle. All you got to do is disconnect it now. This is a family function. How you come to sell the gallery? This is a family function. My point exactly. No, it's not even a car. It's not even a car. This is the laptop. This is laptop. He got the laptop. If he wants you to come to the station, go to the station. So why the police have any evidence for what they have and you don't have no evidence of what you want? You tell him to take off camera. This is what you should have found out in the first place, sir. That is what you should have found out as a police. Who am I? Not just come and do things as rash as it is. I know wherever evidence is, guys, have a substance here. But people, I wonder if that was an illegal gathering right there. You know, I wonder if that is the reason why those police officers went to that place and certain things happened. You see? Yeah, because, you know, there are more than one reasons as to why certain gathering of persons can be considered to be illegal. One, because of the COVID-19 pandemic. You know, at one point I realized that many countries out there in the world don't allow too much persons to be gathered together just to prevent uh, the spread of the COVID-19. So it can be considered to be illegal if too many persons are gathered together. You see, it happened within the country of Jamaica as well. You see what I say? And another reason is if you don't have a permit to keep a party or a function or any large gathering. Yeah, I wonder those things, you know, but you don't know. The video has been talked about on social media and me dancer killer. From a video I get 
a buzz on social media. I'm going to present it to you and you can tell me what you think. You see? Yeah, you can tell me what you think. All right, so big up and respect to each and everyone. And until next time, if you're new to my channel, don't be afraid to click the subscribe button. I'm in the dancer skill. I'm big up. You see it? Hey, man, you can know you watch. Dance, yeah, man. Hey, yo, skiller. You are watching Dance on Skiller Entertainment.